Hi and welcome back to the channel. Today's video is, as promised, a haul of the key pieces that I have bought for February 2023 and beyond. I'm always trying to be conscious of the pieces that I buy and make sure that they work with everything else in my wardrobe, but also that they are pieces that I actually need slash will wear. So first up is this white basic tee from Brandy Melville. It's not a brand that I've ever bought anything from before. Um, however, I had seen a few girls wearing their tees and just their kind of basics, Henleys, etc. Um, on TikTok. So I popped into the store when I was in London and I felt like they had good basics at a good price. I really like the quality. I think this t-shirt was around £15. Um, so for that the quality is really nice and I love the waffle style knit. Um, it is just a basic long sleeve round neck tee but great for everyday use and I'm always looking for elevated basics so definitely check them out. Next up are these Uniqlo trousers. These are the ones that I featured in my come shopping with me video in my last video. And honestly, after a few wears, I just love them. I love Uniqlo in general for basics that are good quality, well priced, and I just find that any basics I've ever bought from them, they just stay in my closet for years, so they're definitely worth it. Um, these trousers were, I think they were £35, which honestly, that's such a good buy because they have a great shape and fit. I really, really love them. Um, but they also have a really good selection of colours, so they have like the basics, the workwear kind of colours, the black, the greys, the camels, but then they also have fun colours like mint green and light blue. So if you are into that, they, they have a great selection of colours for the price. So I've just paired it here with the white Brandy Melville tee and I have added a black belt as well as my Chanel Ballet flats. This look actually reminds me of a look that I have on my Pinterest board that Sophia Ritchie wore and I just think it's such a timeless and elegant um, look for being so simple because essentially it's just white tee and these trousers and both of them together cost less than £50. So I mean such a classic look for a great price really. Um, so yeah I would definitely recommend picking up a few pairs of these trousers, go into Uniqlo, try them on. Um, I will of course leave them linked below but they are called the wide pleated trouser and I am five foot four and I'm wearing a size UK six, well an extra small but I am a UK six and that's my regular size. The next new in piece in my wardrobe is from a brand that does the best elevated basics and you will see me wearing their pieces often but this black everyday blazer from m and is a timeless classic. It's actually called the Very Useful Blazer and it truly is such a beautifully cut black blazer that works with everything. It works with denim, tailoring, it works with leather trousers, it's just that perfect blazer that you need in your capsule wardrobe hence the name. Um, but it has some really gorgeous details that you can see here and the quality um, just elevates it honestly from the cuffs to the lapels and the pocket details it is just such a classic piece. Um, I've paired it here with the Me and M tailored trousers that I've had for a year and worn them so much. Um, it actually matches perfectly with this, um, the details on the cuffs and, and on the trousers you can see here, um, but yeah, it just matches perfectly as a suit. I absolutely love it together um, and I do love my tailoring. And honestly, investing in a classic black blazer is such a great piece to have in your wardrobe. Also, rather than buying them from Zara or somewhere else, Focus on the cut and the tailoring because it is such a simple piece. If it is cut better, it will just look better and last longer. And next up are these black loafers from Flattered. I feel like I was missing loafers in my wardrobe. I needed something to wear with denim and tailored trousers that was chunkier than the ballet flats but still like almost more dressed up than the sneakers. Um, and I've never really owned a pair of them so I got these ones from Flattered and honestly I am obsessed. I have worn them almost every single day since I got them. And last but by no means least, my new boots from Really Wild. 
I seen these when I went into the store in London and honestly I was just obsessed from the minute I seen them. They are beautiful leather riding boots. Well, I'm going to call them riding boots because the last time I wore riding boots in my video, um, someone told me that those boots were too chunky and not tight enough to be riding boots, so these definitely are. Um, but yes, I love them. I literally they i feel like they're also a missing piece in my wardrobe just like super classy super chic and just so well made like i can't even describe to you how beautiful these boots are i did actually take the tassels off of them just because my style isn't super country and i wanted them to be super sleek and chic and um, but yeah i absolutely love them thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one